everyone! Welcome back to Kiki Sika TV and sobrang excited ako sa video natin today kasi I'll be answering one of the most requested videos and posts for my blog and vlog which is my workout equipment at home. So if you're new to my channel, I'm into makeup, skincare, fitness, health, food, and reviewing a lot of products. And if you've been following me on social media, malalaman nyo na I'm really into fitness and working out. Bukod sa pagkain ng marami. And medyo nasa routine ko na ang pag-gym. Pero because of our recent circumstances of the coronavirus pandemic, nag-shut down lahat ng mga fitness centers because it was deemed as non-essential. Pero personally, while it is unsafe to go out in public in the gym, syempre, hindi natin dapat kalimutan ng ating well-being and fitness kasi being fit gives us an additional layer of protection from the virus. So, nung na-announce agad na sarado na yung mga gym, syempre, we must focus on ano na lang, body weight workouts. Pero sometimes it isn't really enough and you need a little bit of help and assistance from equipment. And over the course of the weeks, nag-invest ako on essential workout equipment that we can use safely indoors kahit maliit yung space na meron tayo. Katulad ng akin, share ko lang, sobrang, sobrang liit ng space na ginagamit ko for workout tech. Pakita ko sa inyo. So, itong kakarampot na area na to, ang aking workout space. Dito ko nilalatag yung aking yoga mat. And dito na ako nagsisimula mag-workout. So, tara, pakita ko na sa inyo ang dun 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 Talaga ako pa yung sound effect. Ang aking super excited ako, ang aking small investment of workout equipments. Kasi ito sinabit ko pa dito. <laughs> So, ito guys, bago natin ipasok yung kalkalin yung box, pakita ko muna sa inyo na I have a yoga mat. Kasi ayoko namang mag-workout sa, sa matigas. <laughs> This is 6mm. I bought it from ano, online. From Lazada. Nasa 400 pesos siya. I had it delivered. Kasi pag 4mm masyado manipis. So, nararamdaman mo yung sakit ng sahig and this is wide enough for the for my space for my workout pero hindi siya ganun kalaki na marami siya na occupy it's very space friendly so next up is my small kettlebell collection what I like about kettlebells more than dumbbells is their multi-purpose hindi lang sila alternative to dumbbells for weights but you can also use them for your kettlebell swings, kettlebell lifts, and super daming workout na pwedeng gawin using this piece of equipment. Actually, kahit ito lang muna, pwede na. And I have them in different weights kasi you need one kettlebell, lightweight kettlebell for your arm workouts, and one heavy kettlebell for your leg workouts like squats or deadlifts, and also the kettlebell swings. So, ito yung akin. I have four in different weight classes. So, this is 10 pounds. This is uh, 6 kilograms. This is 12 kilograms. And this is uh, 20 pounds. So, ang madalas ko nagagamit dito ay ito for my arm workouts. Um, windmills, races, dumbbell curls, kettlebell curls, and presses. And this one I use for swings, squats, deadlifts. Ito pag single leg with when I need the lighter weight. Super saya ng feeling na meron kang weight sa bahay. And mas, ano siya, I find it mas space friendly. And since multifunctional siya than dumbbells alone. But I still have the dumbbells din ako. Saan yun? Ito. For my, uh, for my lat races and curls. Also from Ensayo, and 5 pounds each, dalawa. And after showing you my weights, halugugin na natin ang aking box of treasure or workout equipment. So I have this. Ito, this is a 
uh, barbell foam from band. Dati ginagamit ko to, dinadala ko to sa gym for supporting, hindi sa squats eh, sa hip, hip thrusts. Kasi masakit sa buto, sa hips yung barbell, so pang support. Pero ngayon, ginagamit ko siya as pang, I step on it if I need an additional platform when doing my leg workouts. So this is a foam. This one naman, I have this in different weight classes. These are called glute bands. They're made out of fabric. So, mas gusto ko yung fabric than ito. Meron din akong glute bands na elastic. Uh, this one is in... Ano, hindi elastic eh. So, these resistance bands are made out of latex. I also have them in different weight classes. So, the thicker the latex band is, the heavier the resistance. So, mas manipis, mas magaan. Mas manipis, mas madaling gamitin. So, marami rin workout dito, with which I'll be sharing later. While these are cloth that I love using for my glute bridges, hip thrusts, and other leg workout. Kasi it adds, um, more challenge to your leg workouts and leg routines like squats. Napapakita ko rin later. And I love yung color. It's rainbow! I also have these uh, pink push-up bars. Pakita ko sa inyo yung pink push-up bars. That I use, syempre, for push-up and chest workouts. And the additional uh, height gives more challenge to my push-ups and nakakabawa siya ng stress and strain sa wrists. Kung ano lang, kung flat lang. So, these are mini resistance bands out of latex pero I'll show you something else. Ito yung mas madalas kong nagagamit which is a longer version of the resistance bands. Pwede mo siya kang kabit anywhere and you can use them for uh, different exercises like um Lat pull downs, triceps push downs, and actually, pwede rin siya sa mga leg workouts. This also have. Same with the smaller resistance bands. The thicker it is, the heavier yung pressure niya and resistance and weight. So, the more challenging it is. I highly recommend getting the red one if you're a beginner. And the black one. Black. For. Heavy resistance, so mas challenging siya so you can use this for your legs or for your upper body workouts then. So I also have a jumping rope. I, I have a jumping rope kasi mas prefer ko to than running or cycling kasi this can be done in tours. You can jump jump rope anywhere and this is a speed rope that I bought from Booty Bands PH. And last but not the least, ito yung pinakabago kong equipment, pero ito na yata isa sa favorite ko, which is the power sliders, also from Booty Bands PH. So, para saan to? Para to pag gusto nyo mag-floor wax. Joke lang. Um, usually, ginagamit to sa mga core workouts for to make the planks more challenging. Wow! Challenging na nga ang plank. Gagawin pang more challenging. And also, for your leg workout, like sliding leg curls, which I'll be showing also to you later. Ito siya, ganito siya. Pakita ko, ganyan. Ganyan. Pero if you, you have a carpeted surface, ito yung nasa ilalim. So, it's dual-sided. So, yeah, diba? Ayan, guys. Thank you for joining me on today's video. Sana may natutunan kayo and nag-enjoy kayo. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I hope to see you soon. Follow me on all my social media accounts and ingat, stay safe, stay fit, stay healthy, love you.